I bet with Internet only. They're a fantastic site. I've never had any issues with them. They are very professional. There's never a problem. You deposit money, two seconds later it's in your account. You withdraw, which I do very occasionally. And uh, I believe it's also two seconds it's in your account. Race number three on the program, the start of the pick six, 1400 meters, the trip, a maiden plate that jumps at 13.35. And uh, we've got a scratching in this contest, that of horse number two, Red Mountain. So it's now uh, reduced a field of 13 runners. So let's get into our interview package. Alison Wright, Stuart Ferry, Nicola Drosko, and Michael yes, Roberts. Yes, I think for Delicious, definitely preferred the grass last time. He's um, come on from that run and uh, expect, expecting further improvement from him. Yeah, listen, last time running a good race, probably maybe just a little bit too much in front. Um, so this time a little bit more conservatively. And uh, yeah, listen, uh, he's fitting well at home and he should run another good race. Yeah, look, he ran a nice race over the 1,200. Uh, he's a type of horse, he, he kind of doesn't travel the first part and then finish his race. The 12 was a bit sharp. It's quite a competitive field, I think, for Sunday. Uh, but yeah, look, uh, with his last run, if he can produce that, he'll definitely be in the shake-up. Yes, the draw is a problem there, a little bit. Uh, He's a nice horse. Uh, he, he ran a nice race even last time with him. I'm, you know, I'm very happy with his progress. So I think he will be competitive. Having a look at the fixed odds at best in market, it is quite a competitive contest. I surrender tops the boards at 33 to 10, 7 to 2 about Putulicious. It's 9 to 2 about Irish Luck, 11 to 2 Fire Tonic, Spec Magic. Then you get an 8 to 1 and better ball though. So there's quite a few horses in with winning chances in this contest and. A few of them have a bad, sort of a deep draw to uh, contend with, but I think that uh, it's a type of race where you need to include a few in the in the exotics. These, uh, what's your th what's your thoughts on uh, race number three? Well, uh, now that there's uh, what's it uh, going to be 13 runners go to post, so I'm going to go with my rule in the pick six, and it's going to be very simple. You can jot these numbers down: numbers one, three, four. 7, 11, 13, 1, 3, 4, 7, 11, 13. I think you'll be safe. I'm very confident with those numbers. And I think after the running of race number three, uh, you know, I'm including what's at uh, six runners. Yeah, even if the pick six is paying less than that, around four or five rand, it's not a bad start for you. But uh, if you're getting an excess of six rand, then you're in the green, as they say, after leg one. But uh, the place accumulates. I only had two runners here in the place accumulator, numbers one and two, uh, with number two being out now. So everything will lie on number one. But if you're looking for cover uh, with number two, I'm going to go with uh, Michael Roberts's confidence there. I like the way he spoke about Plattenberg because I looked at the source as my third choice and Rachel Vinica and Michael was really nice to see Michael bounce back to some form uh, at our last meeting here in KZN and uh, when uh, these stables come back to form, then it's worth taking note of. And I think uh, he could have a fair day at Hollywood Bet Scottsville. So in my place accumulator, I'm just going to include two runners, uh, numbers one, and I will correct it when I go through that suggested bet. Instead of two, I'm going to be including number 11. But I'll repeat my pick six numbers, one, three, four, seven, eleven, and 13. Yeah, horse number 11, Plettenberg, could be some nice value. Last time out, Richard Furry took the ride and actually thought he had run a very nice race. He was well held behind Common Grounds on that occasion, but uh, Common Grounds was a facile win off his maiden. So he's definitely a, a nice uh, value choice in this race. I think uh, the likes of number 13, Irish Luck, and uh, Chase Mojan rides number four, Spec Magic, another one that uh, you have to uh, possibly include. But you heard from these numbers 137. 11 and 13, the numbers to play around in race number three on the program. And number four. And number four, yes, yes. Number four, Spec Magic as well. So that's six horses to play around in race number three. It does look to be a race where the principal contenders should possibly dominate. But um, as you heard from D's number 11, Plettenberg, he's going to be the cover with number one, Putulicious, in that uh, suggested bet. Uh, my name's Danny Deliberto, founder of Ladles of Love. It was founded back in 2014. The communities we, we work with are all over the peninsula and um, we're working with 138 beneficiaries now. We've grown exponentially. Um, we've been able to do that because of all the kindness that we have experienced um, from individuals and corporates such as uh, Interbet who just want to be part of the change.